Okay. Ooh. Yeah. Maybe we should show that. Yeah, it doesn't like the pole. Yeah. This tromboncino does not like the cold. Um, yes. oh. Okay, this is the color that it should be. But I think because of this, I don't think it's gonna store for very long. Okay. The purpose of letting it mature is so that it'll store for a long time like a winter squash or a butternut or a pumpkin. Okay, how are we looking over here? We have bug eaten um, cauliflower. Wow. Or is this cabbage? Cause that one looks like, <laughs> that one's shredded. Have you checked this lately? Yeah, I was looking for worms. I can't find them. There is the traveling, the walking onions. They're not walking yet. Don't know when they will. <coughs> and volunteer potatoes. I don't know how interesting this is, but this is a yellow calendula. This is a lighter yellow calendula, and we've got an orange one coming. <laughs> and I struggled really hard to keep those alive during the summer, but the, it, they're really happy now. They like the cooler temperatures, I think. Okay, we have a our new trees on a drip system. Kim just turned it on, so we're checking them out. Yeah, that one's on. No, yeah, I need to turn it on. It's not on. No, this one's wet. Yeah, I think I had it on, and then I got confused as to whether it was on or not. Oh. All right, heading to the West Garden. Let's see, this is probably turned off. Nope, it's on. Oh, okay. Lately, we haven't been that good about turning that on. Oh. Uh, what? We have a bird inside the netting. Oh. All right. There, I'll let you see him. Because when I go over there, I don't want to panic, panic him too much. And just let him out as fast as possible. Okay, I used a really scientific method to get the bird out of the netting, which was scare the hell out of him. All right. I have a confession to make um, and an apology to my son. He told me once he was um, dating a girl who her dad let him help out on the farm. I said, how big's the farm? He said, an acre. And I laughed. I said, well, we're on an acre. That's not a farm. But I had a realization this morning that definition of a farm in my opinion is somewhere where you're growing something so our one acre is a farm a single green stalk on a balcony is farming so sorry sean i was wrong are they You left that half-eaten one intentionally, right? No. Oh. oh. I thought you left one. There's another one right there. Eaten? No. Uh, further in. Ooh, that one's nasty. This? Yeah. <laughs> they all had blossom in, right? Yeah, they all do. Yeah. Oh, look. Fucking rabbit. <laughs> Dag nabbit Take rabbit. Take that. Let me feed you. All right, I need to buy pellets today. <laughs> this morning. There you go. I'm going to pick up a case of quart jars. Okay. So it was a little 
brisk this morning. Woke up to 45 degrees. Did I tell you that, Kim? Yeah. This thermometer yeah. said 45. Burr. So, yeah. Fall is upon us. Officially, it's been upon us for a couple weeks now. But now we're really feeling it. Woke up at 6 o'clock this morning and it was still dark. Yeah, not a big fan of that. I want to do an experiment. I have heard that they say when you're coming on fall for the indeterminate tomatoes, top them, cut the top part of growth and that'll say that the plant's under stress and to ripen all the fruit. Oh, so that makes sense. So say we do one, but not the other. Okay, so a test and hold subject. I it's like. not a perfect test, but it's better than nothing. Yeah, no, I like that a lot. Oh, gotcha. This is a watermelon leaf. This is a small watermelon leaf. Yeah, my bird picked it in one spot. Let's see if that kills it. Although, if we, um, sacrifice one melon to keep the other ones alive. I'm okay with that. Oh, God, yeah. A kajari? Yeah, I think so, but the kajaris are small. I don't know. Hmm. Well, that one's not huge, at least not yet. Right, but the ones I've seen are like this. Oh. But I, it could be. I don't know. We'll, when we cut it open, we'll decide. Okay. Our beans are dying, but we expected that. Are we going to pick those and dry I mean... Yeah, we'll pick them. And then, honestly, this is enough for seed next year. It's yeah. not enough to eat. Yeah, okay. We just didn't have good luck. Oh, these were volunteer anyway, weren't they? No, I oh, planted they weren't? them. Oh, they weren't? I planted them. Didn't realize that. And of A course, couple of times because I planted them all along here and the bunnies kept eating them. Ah. And I think that's what I planted here, too. I was trying to get a good mess of beans, and right. it just didn't work out. I remember that now. <clears throat> and the loofah's right above you. Limbo! <laughs> so that's it for this morning. I'm going to film, so I'm off. See ya.